The day was going to be spent on board Lang's boat. We met Lang three years ago, and he, alongside Justin, his friend, helped us land our biggest ever fish, a nine foot, 11 inch sturgeon from the Fraser River. This time we were back on the Fraser, fishing a slightly different area, but hoping we could have the same luck as our first visit to the country. So this time uh, we're gonna use uh, circle hooks instead of J hooks. So the only difference is uh, we're not running up to the rod and setting the hook. We're gonna let the fish take, the fish is gonna turn, swim away, and that's where the hook is gonna catch them at the side of the mouth every time. So the process would be you see the bite, start reeling down on it, the fish will start swimming off and it's on. So no hook set. Before when we see the, when we have the J hooks, we see the bite, we set it, sometimes we miss it. Well this way, you, when they nibble, you don't, you don't need to set, you know what I mean? Because we want them to eat the whole thing and you know for sure you have them, you know? It wasn't just the pattern of hook that had changed, it was also the bait choice. We were earlier in the year this trip and Lang chose to use sections of salmon meat instead of a ball of eggs to match what the sturgeon would naturally be feeding on. As you can see in this footage, the sturgeon tend to be quite shy biters, picking up and dropping the bait multiple times. Clearly it was going to require a little patience and a bit of luck to connect with our first sturgeon of the trip. So we're gonna try and catch some smaller ones. Just to get, uh, to get back into the groove of things, you know? Yeah. How small is small? Um, I think four or five feet or so. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, no, he's still there. No, no, he's better. Oh, no. no. <laughs> oh. There you go, yeah. he's on. He's yeah. on. There we go. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and just crank it down, yeah. Oh. Yeah. I forgot how hard they fly. <laughs> they usually jump within the first. I'll soon after. One to like 20 seconds. So not jump. <laughs> it's a good warm up. Yeah. Oh, we got a bite on On the head. Shh. Remember, head? calm sorry. down, sorry. calm down. Sorry. This guy. Sorry. Getting too excited. <laughs> Say that on film, okay? <laughs> if not, I'll say what's on number two. Oh, you gotta do it slow. Oh, it's already going. There we go. Don't film anymore. This is the film of shame. <laughs> Put your gloves on. Take a quick photo. My first sturgeon in three years. That's a good feeling to get one. Not so good feeling on my back because it's already hurting from that fight. <laughs> Apparently we've got some bigger ones to catch. Oh, one. One. Oh, he's on. Get him. Oh! Pull it out of the big Hold, 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 hold. Jump, this one. He's going to jump. He's coming up. Yeah, he's coming up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a big one. Jeez. Whoa. <laughs> Not going to lie, it's a thing it might be a bit bigger than your one. Sorry, man. I don't want to carp fish anymore. Lang rigged me up with the harness so we could maximize the drag and make use of the 150 pound braid we were using. Well, you know when they put you in the harness, <laughs> you got a serious fish on the end. But apparently you can land them a lot quicker by uh, attaching yourself to them. Sturgeon number one for me. <laughs> I completely forgot how impressive these creatures are. Like, 
I know it's been three years, but well, don't really know what to say <laughs> other than yeah, cheers, Lang. Well, thank you guys for coming again. But this this is not our goal. Our goal is something bigger than we were last time. So bring it on, yeah. man! Bring it on. <laughs> if this is the biggest fish we catch this trip, though, I'm a happy guy. Very happy. One down, God knows how many more to go. That was epic. Ah, oh, awesome. Perfect, don't waste time. <laughs> <laughs> well, we just lost a sturgeon, but as Justin says, it's just a quick release for the small ones. Job. Well, we just released that because apparently it's not big enough. I'm worn out, my back hurts and apparently that fish wasn't big enough. This is about the most chilled fishing you can get. Just put the rods out, let the fish just come along, find the baits, while we also have a nibble on a barbecue. Can't really beat it. Uh, we'll get comments on the video saying, um, so if I book a uh, trip with Lang's Fishing Adventures, does Justin come in, included in the package? Because <laughs> like, if it is a slow day, I know you don't get slow days very often, but if it is a slow day, you kind of need some entertainment. That's what I am. <laughs> something to talk to, something to tell Yeah, and Justin is perfect. He's coming up, he's up, he's up. Oh! Right! Yeah. <laughs> no, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> when he puts on that extra drag, it's damn bad extra. It's a little bit extra. Safe to say there's nothing in fresh water that does this anywhere else. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually in pain right now. Got a big un. Beautiful. There we go. Sun setting behind us. And we've got ourselves a beautiful sturgeon. <laughs> it's just a monster fish. It's huge. Look at it. What a day. What a day. Thanks, man. Love it. We fished a little longer that evening, but to no avail, heading back to the boat launch just as the sun set. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is still filming. It is. <laughs> Good job you remembered that. I know, I'm sticking my rod down. I can't <laughs> Cheers, man. Our first day targeting sturgeon in the Fraser River had been a massive success, but nothing could have prepared us for the action-packed day of fishing which followed. Oh, oh he's fooling me. No. Dude, no. Tell me, so I'll, I'll, I'll suck it in. <laughs> <laughs> This type of fishing. I love how it jumps so close. Yeah. I don't know what to say. It just keeps surprising you. 
It's a baby! <laughs> Here we have the biggest fish of the trip so far. Whoa. Yes! Don't know what to say. See you, mate. Good job, mate. I think it was like, I think this is 26 now. Average of seven feet. Can't complain. Double, 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 It's a double! Whoa! Woohoo! This one feels pretty big. Whoa! Okay, come take this rod now. I'll take, I'll take that rod. Right now. <laughs> yes. There you go. That one's done. You think, you think I'm ready for this? Yes, you are. I'm not. The last one. Yeah, a double. It's the end of the day. Why does it stop? Literally, last knockings. The sun is just going down. And we've got two. As if yesterday wasn't good enough, today has topped things off beautifully. Thank you, Lang. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's great having you guys here. And that was it, the end of our visit to Canada. And as we waved goodbye to our last version of the trip, we also said goodbye to a country which had provided us with such incredible fishing, and of course, the people who made it all possible. Mm -hmm.